the BBL era and all of this, I feel like it's really, it's making the insecure men show their insecurities. And it's making like... What do you mean by that? I feel like, okay... This okay. This is how I feel, and I feel like this is about women too. Mm-hmm. I feel like women who don't have their body done always bashing women who got their body done. Oh, why would you want this and why would you want that? And oh, men only want this and men only want that. But I'm just like, why do you care? Well, yeah, because typically women that are in the gym and have they you know body naturally right. together, they don't care because like what I got to care. I'm already yeah. Right. And that's a good point. It might be the women that, you know, maybe they would do it if they could if or they could. Or they So yeah. they bashing the women that got mm-hmm. their body done and stuff like that because mm-hmm. maybe they can't. Maybe, you know what I'm saying? It, it could be whatever it is, but most they times be it's because they can't. Yeah. And yeah. and it's making them insecure, right? Because yeah. they feel like the men that they want want the women that look like that. Mm-hmm. You feel me? So that's the only reason why you're speaking on it. Yeah. But I feel like I feel like even with the women, if you're doing it for yourself, if you feel like, oh, men don't want this and men don't want that, yeah, they do. You just got to find a man for you, right? Just because a man, and I've I've fallen trapped to this too. I dated somebody who everybody that he dated was Mm. like BBL, Mm. like what you would identify as an Instagram baddie. And for me, I feel like I was feeling like, okay, I know I look good. I know I'm fine. I know I'm the pretty around the way girl. Mm -hmm. But I think in my mind, I had like my own idea of what was beautiful. And when I was like looking at that image, I was like, oh, that's pretty. That's what I, you know, want to look like or what I wanted. So it always- The used to mess with? Yes, you would say yes. that about his previous track record. But I'm not telling him that. I'm okay. thinking that, you know, okay. and I feel like it started showing out in our relationship, right? And I think I was making myself insecure and not realizing that the truth be told is that it don't even be about that. When when a man chooses you, like sometimes it be about that, but mm-hmm. other times you you'll see a man who all his women is Instagram baddies. Mm-hmm. But the woman he marry, mm-hmm. Ass flatter than pancakes, like again. That's why I said in earlier, it's all about the preconceived or preconceived notions. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I think oh, I hope I said that right because I really want to feel smart <laughs> right now. But yeah, because I mean, at the end of the day, it's about what you want out of that shit. Yeah. Like if you want, if you, if he wanted you to, did he ever mention that he wanted you to look like them? No. You know what I'm no, saying? Because he, no. he he had I me. I'm thinking he had a higher. A status in his mind of as far as where you were. Mm-hmm. You were different for a reason. Yeah. He could have easily picked another chick that looked like them. Right. You didn't. That's for a reason. Right. You know what I'm saying? But people just have to realize that. Like, women have to realize, you know what I'm saying? Really open up your eyes and see what it is he want with you. And then dudes, you know what I'm saying? I mean, act accordingly. Just keep it a buck with it. That's what I do. Women got to love themselves. That's what it come down to. Everybody do. You know, because a man not loving himself might lead to him wanting only the joints with the fattest asses. Because yeah. if it's a joint that body probably ain't as curvaceous, mm-hmm. real or fake, then he's like, damn, that shit ain't gonna make me look good. Yeah, but I think that's what it. I feel like that's what I kind of learned from that situation is that you. I feel like a lot of our arguments really stem from my own insecurities. Mm. And insecurities that I created in my own mind. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Out. Yeah, mm. and I think like because I had my own idea of what a person wanted or what a person was into, and the truth be told is you don't even know what the reason a person was talking to such and such or right. whatever. With you know what I'm saying? You yeah. really just gotta love yourself and be confident in yourself, mm. and that's gonna bring the right energy and the right people to you. Always. But when you insecure about yourself and you're not happy, because I'm gonna tell you. One thing that relationship did made me do is get my ass in shape. Yeah. And and and, it, and I love that about during it. During or after the relationship? After. After. Yeah, like why not during? Why do y'all wait? Okay, let's so, do it. No, 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 <laughs> no. Let's talk about it. Why during the relationship y'all get the happy weight? Yeah. But then when y'all break up, that's when y'all want to hit the gym and tone the body up. Well, you know what? I feel like it's just the best revenge. Like, right? So maybe in the in the midst of that that relationship, like maybe I was in the works of trying to get myself together. Maybe mm-hmm. I'm like, 
you know, trying to start eating right and stuff like that. But, you know, the results take time. So now I'm going harder. You know what I'm saying? Because for one, I'm the catch. I'm the catch. And I'm and I, then at that point, I was realizing that I'm like. Afterwards, you realized it. I was. Yeah, because in the midst of it. With this during person, you're the, but during you're the, catch, you're the catch as well during Brooklyn. I am. And you, you know, know I mean? you know, the problem was hmm. the problem was is that because he was so he was in a more high pro- profile status mm-hmm. and the women that he had dated before were more in a high profile status. Mm-hmm. I felt like 